If mediocrity was the standard, the history of our world would be totally different. I'm Gary Greenfield. I ask you, were the great kingdoms of Egypt mediocre in their impact on the ancient world? Were the founders of the great religions of the world mediocre in their vision? Was Marco Polo a mediocre explorer of the Far East? Were the great Renaissance artists mediocre in their creativity? Were the founding fathers of the United States mediocre in their vision for a new country? Were the pioneers who followed the mantra, go west, mediocre in the courage they demonstrated? Well, I could continue to blah, blah, blah with those kinds of questions. You get the point though. If you are willing to accept mediocrity, you will at best get blah results. Why would you do that to yourself? You get one chance at this opportunity we call life. Why make it a blah existence? Why not stop with the blah, blah, blah about all the things in your life that are holding you back? I've got a news flash for you. You're holding yourself back. None of the examples cited in the questions I posed earlier held themselves back. You are just as capable as they were. The only difference between you and them is they went and did it and you are still thinking about it. Don't accept mediocrity. Avoid it by developing a dream with which you have a deep emotional connection. Follow your dream by doing what you must, not just what you want. Listen to your heart, not the naysayers who will want to dissuade you from your dream. Be willing to risk your currently safe place for the wonder of a new place, realizing your dream. Do those four things and your life will accelerate well beyond mediocrity. All the best. Talk to you next time.